What's Cracker Jack and SM? Welcome back to another episode of Eagle TV 2.0. Today we have a great show filled with great entertainment. First, we have news with Brody, some silly smacking segments, and entertainment with Christina. Buckle up because this show is blasting off. This is your host, Jacob. And this is your host, Casey. Today we have a muy bueno show lined up for you guys, so let's jump right in. Jacob, have you been watching the news lately? No, sorry, Bob, I haven't. Well, that's just perfect. We have Brody here to keep us updated on the local news. That sounds swell. Take it away, Brody. What's up, SM? I'm Brody Sazna. I'm here to take you, to, here to deliver your Southern California news report. There were tsunami warnings from a volcanic explosion in Tonga, closing all the beaches in Orange County as of last week. NASA reports the massive explosion that only happens roughly every thousand years was so large it was visible from space. The explosion triggered a 7.4 magnitude earthquake and sent tsunami waves crashing into the coast of the Pacific Island, leaving it covered in ash and cut off from aid. Here in Orange County, there were tsunami warnings all along the coast and the beaches were closed. Over the weekend, I got to go to the San Clemente Pier and I just, just a few days after the beaches reopened and the waves didn't look any larger than normal. There were surfers and plenty of people enjoying their day at the beach. I think it's safe to say that it's safe to go to the beach and have fun. That's all I have for you today, SM. Back to Casey and Jacob. Muchas gracias, Brody. That tsunami really threw a wave at me. <laughs> yes, I agree. Thank you for keeping us updated, Brody. Moving forward, Jacob, do you think you're smart? Uh, yeah, I think I'm pretty smart. Oh yeah? Spell it. S-M-A-R-T. You are wrong. I said spell it. I-T. Aw, oh, nuts. You got me with that one, Casey. Good thing we have Lauren with a spelling bee for us. Take it away, Lauren. Hey, SM. I'm Lauren. And I'm Taryn. And today we're going to test some of your guys' knowledge on basic spelling words. Let's check it out. I'm here with Kyle. How do you spell definitely? Definitely. D E. F I E N T L Y. That's incorrect. With Aaron, how do you spell entrepreneur? Entrepreneur is spelled E N T R E P R E um, N E U R N E U R. That's correct. I'm here with Callie. How do you spell environment? E N V I R O N M E N T. That's correct. I'm here with Jacob. How do you spell maneuver? M-A-N-U-V-E-R. That's incorrect. Thanks for watching, guys. Now back to the host. Wow, that was very educational. Yes, thank you, Lauren. Moving on. Hey, Jacob, you getting hungry? As a matter of fact, I am, Casey. Good thing we have Christina here with the top restaurants in Orange County. The floor is yours, Christina. Good morning, SM. Today I'm going to be sharing with you five of SM's favorite restaurants in the OC. The first restaurant is Carmelita's. It is located right here in Rancho Santa Margarita at the Mercado de Lago Shopping Center. The restaurant is festively decorated, giving it a true Mexican vibe, and it has beautiful views of Lake RSM. The next restaurant, SM said, was Nobu. Nobu has locations all around the world. In Southern California, there are locations in Malibu, Los Angeles, and Newport Beach. The classy Japanese chain's food are all creations from Chef Nobu. Nobu was founded in 1994, featuring their signature black cotton miso. Another restaurant is mentioned by SM students is Las Colandrias. The family-owned business was founded in 1984, known for their takeout, catering, and deli. The original location is in San Juan Capistrano, but they also have locations in Capistrano Beach, Laguna Niguel, San Clemente, and Mission Viejo. Another restaurant SM students recommended is Picolinas. This Italian restaurant has all the classics. It is located in Mission Viejo. Lastly, Ruby's Diner was also put high on the favorites list. Founded on December 7th of 1982 on Balboa Pier in Newport Beach, their Ruby's Burger and Shakes are the classics. 
with locations in Anaheim, Balboa Pier, Brea, Carlsbad, Laguna Beach, Corona Del Mar, Mission Viejo, Orange, and many more. Well, that's all I have for you today. Let's send it back to Casey and Jacob. Which is your favorite restaurant to go to, Jacob? Uh, I'd have to go to with Hannah Steakhouse. That place is buzzing. Yes, I agree. Going on, are you good at reading lips? Um, I guess. Coincidentally, we have Oz today with her headphone TikTok challenge to show us how it's done. Let's see it. Hey everyone, I'm Miranda. And I'm Ozade. And today we're doing the headphone challenge, which basically entails that I'm gonna play music in my AirPods and put in my headphones. And then Ozade is just gonna mouth some words to me and we're gonna see if I get them. Are you ready? Yeah. I also have only three tries to get it right. All right, first one. A pain for your thoughts. I'm not going to college. <laughs> nice try. A penny for your thoughts. I'm opening my presents. A penny for your thoughts. I don't know it. All right, next one. Cut corners. I like oranges. Cut corners. Try again. I don't know it. Okay, last one. A grain of salt. An arrangement <laughs> of grapes. <laughs> a grain of salt. Five stars. A grain of salt. Rainforest Cafe. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, my turn to try. How did I do? Awful, these were what they were. <laughs> I didn't get it. <laughs> now that was pretty cool. Oh, I completely agree. Okay, last up is my all-time favorite segment. Oh yes, it's our awesome racing segment. Let's see it. Today, we're gonna be asking people to race. All right, we're here with Charlie Lee and he's gonna be our first racer. He's gonna race Casey. Let's see it. <laughs> oh, oh Casey God. is the winner. Uh, oh yeah, how do you Charlie, feel about that? Charlie. How do you feel about that? GG, bro. Thanks for racing me, man. All right. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Thanks for Appreciate racing, Charlie. It, man. All right, today I'm going to be racing Nolan, and let's see it. All right, Nolan's off to a good, oh my gosh, Nolan just blew Brody out of the water. He blew him out of the water. <laughs> Looks like Leo's off with a good start, but Jacob's been stretching, so it looks like he might catch up. Oh, nope. Leo wins. <laughs> what do you have to say? I know, bro. All right, guys, thanks for watching. As again, I'm Jacob Lerlo. And I'm Brody Sazna. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Wow, that was fun. Yes, I agree. Maybe we should race sometime, Casey. That would be pretty entertaining. Well, that about wraps up today's show. I'm Jacob Letterlow. And I'm Casey Weatherby. Have, Have an, an exuberant, exuberant day, SM. SM.